So tell us a little bit about this project. How would you describe Dancefort to someone uninitiated with the company and its work? Well, like maybe many things, it started, I remember, over a conversation we had maybe five years ago. Uh, we had finished a, a, a work called Necessary Beauty uh, that premiered in 2008. And in the making of that work, there are many, uh, many kind of uh, under the radar elements that um, were very important to our process. And, and we were talking about how, geez, you know, we, in the piece we were dealing with dark matter, but there's no way for people to know that specifically, uh, or even to find us through dark matter. Not the, this kind of dark matter. <laughs> well, it was the, the idea concept. that you wanted those, the idea of those connections, that if you were searching for dark matter, or these unseen, uh, influence or things like that, that you actually could follow that and it would take you to the Necessary Beauty or the Beauty Miller Company. And it was this notion of we're not showing up in the ways that we could be with the new technology and how can we, what can we do to address that? And I think that it, that, that it wasn't obviously just about that one piece, but just that there's a way of looking at choreographic process that is fairly unseen by, by the public. So maybe there might be some over, um, overreaching element that they could um, investigate the work or process through that. So the idea of dance fort is kind of a play fort, you know, like let's go in and find stuff. Right. Um, it came up. 